For FSD, narrow road is a problem. Sunlight makes the camera blind, another problem. So the real question is, can a hardware 3 Tesla ever truly master full self-driving? Hey everyone, welcome back to another full self-driving video version 12.5.4.2 in New York. And my name is Nato. I love to film Tesla full self-driving because I love this technology, I love Teslas, and I love their vision. No other car in the world can do it right now. So, you know, the car is making a right turn and it is already make that right turn because there is no other vehicle on our left side. Very good job, but immediately the screen is saying pay attention. Probably I was just looking at the screen for a second. So, you know, like, so I had to just, you know, like look straight and then a notification just goes away. Very good. So we are going and we have to stay in this lane, the left lane, because on that upcoming stop sign, we are going to merge. And for this, we need to stay in this left lane because we're going to merge from the left lane. But you'll see something different. The light's gonna change from green to yellow, but we can definitely pass. As you can see, there are like two other vehicle just passed from our right side and then the light changed. But our car is very cautious, doesn't wanna go. So, you know, like FSD, you know, you understand that, like what I'm talking about. Our car is definitely not that much of confident to doing this. So. The light just changed and we are moving forward as you can see. And this is what I was talking about. If you are noticing that navigation at the upcoming stop sign, we're gonna march from left. And if you're seeing that white car, it will do the thing that we want to do but previous time the car fails in version 12.5.4.1 but in this version 2 we can do it and this time the car didn't even hesitate and gets into this lane perfectly but previously in this exact software the car do it at the very last moment so for this, I think like the car was following that white car. Very good. Like if you can follow that, that's good. But you don't make mistake by changing the lane at the very last moment. I don't like it. Nobody will like it. Like if there is another car behind us, then it will be a problem, guys, right? Also, guys, if you guys are new in this channel, please hit that subscribe button because this is the only free way you can support me as a content creator. And I would really appreciate that. So hit that subscribe button and turn that notification bell on for future videos. Now we're going to make a left turn in this narrow road where the car always makes mistake. You will see the car is hesitating and the steering wheel is doing left and right and we are stuck. But this time the car has a space in front of it. So it just rerouting us and just going straight, not making that left turn. But previously when the car was making that left turn, it doesn't have that much space in my previous videos. So it couldn't just make that left or even can't even go straight because the car doesn't have that capabilities to reverse the car. And here you will see also a little hesitation because of those part car and the steering wheel, but this time the car did it perfectly without any problem. There is no stop sign. You will see the car didn't even stop. There is another road, right? There could be cars coming from both sides, but the car slows down but didn't stop. I didn't like the idea and you will see something very weird we are gonna stop on this stop sign we're gonna make a right turn we're gonna creep but our car will just get a stock like again like the like I don't get that like why you're just gonna keep getting a stock like but this time I'll not press that acceleration the car will calculate by itself and making this right turn so my question is why you can do it at the very first moment like why like you can do it by yourself like after five seconds so we are definitely got stuck for a few moments right guys so you know like just please leave a comment below why you think this is happening so we're gonna try that narrow road one more time so i'm just gonna engage it one more time guys so as you guys can see the car is moving forward but this times uh, you know like situation is completely different because 
the car is very confident this time. It is doing some, you know, like left, right, if you are noticing that uh, graphics, but it did it this time, like without any problem, very confidently because last few times exactly in this road, the car is failing every single time, guys. Really don't know why. I have no idea why. Like, I don't get it, like why? So, you know, you can just only comment below that what you think. So I'm just gonna test one more time because I just need to get like the solution why it's just getting a stock. First time it failed, second time it nailed it with confidence and now the third time it is making it, you'll see the steering wheel hesitation, making all the way left and then just getting a stock one more time. It couldn't calculate the space between left and right and also in front of us. I know there is a fence and that's why the car is probably thinking I'll probably gonna hit but what I'm gonna do I'm just gonna take over rotate my steering wheel all the way to the left side and press that acceleration and I can easily do it so you know like just leave a comment guys what do you think why this is happening so i took over i rotated the steering wheel all the way left and i just pressed that acceleration didn't do anything else i didn't back out so um just i just need your opinion i just need your comment why you think this is happening and now we're gonna test that unprotected left turn unprotected left number one in new york hardware 3 vehicle the sun can definitely blind the cameras so we're gonna also see how the car handles this sun situation too because in this exact road the car sometimes definitely gets blind so there is a stop sign coming in front of us so we need to stop here behind this stop sign and then we have to creep a little bit to look on our left side and then we have to go straight not make a right turn okay so you're making a right turn now uh, like don't like the idea but now you're trying to fix it there is no other vehicle behind us so now you can make this u-turn from here there is no other vehicle it's saturday there is less traffic and you make that u-turn perfectly so i will definitely give it a pass but it could definitely, you know, like just go in this block on my left side. It could just come here and make that U-turn from there. But it decided to go make a right turn, go straight. And the next block, it just make that U-turn. So let's find out one more time, guys, how the car FSD handles this unprotected lap. Unprotected left number two in New York Hardware 3 vehicle version 12.5.4.2 and the sun is directly hitting in the cameras hopefully the car will handle this and we're gonna go straight make a right turn but we have to go straight and stop in this stop sign look on our left side then we have to go straight not yep it is saying take over immediately i know i know i know like i know like why so you you just saw that guys like there is just you know like the camera is blind probably we, yes the fsd just pops up so i'm gonna engage it one more time we can go straight exactly the same mistakes now okay okay now this time okay it was trying it was definitely trying to go in that lane to make that u-turn but now there is traffic coming from the opposite but we can definitely make that u-turn very good job immediately make that the same thing like the last time the car handles it perfectly very good job so you know like we're gonna do one more time guys because i'm not impressed with this unprotected left because the sun last time it didn't block the camera but this time it blocks the camera so we're gonna try one more time so let's do it guys unprotected left number three last time the camera gets blinded because of the sun but this time we're gonna see if the car gets blind too so we are proceeding, we're gonna make a right turn and immediately make a U-turn on this upcoming road, but we have to stop for the stop sign, very good. And this time the car, car handles, but it, it passed that white line this time. No, don't go, there is cars on our left side. So this time definitely the car crossed that white line because of the sun, probably it couldn't see that a white line. It shouldn't go, no, 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 no. It shouldn't go like that um you know like white tahoe we should go over there and make that u-turn this time it is doing it very good i like this this is what i was talking about last time it goes to here like the next block but this time it goes 
in the right place and making this U-turn a little slow, but it did it perfectly, so no complaint at all. We make that happen. So very good job, guys. Let me know in the comments about uh, the performance of FSDs in today's video. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button because if you want to support me as a content creator, that will be amazing. I really would appreciate that. And uh, yeah, thank you for watching. And if you want to grab our FSD Beta Bumper Magnet from my website, the link is also in the description. Thanks for watching, guys. I love you and have a wonderful, wonderful day.